Water has been restored to most homes and businesses in Little Italy. The area flooded after a water main was broken in a construction mishap. Here's a closer look at the affected area. It's West Date near India Street. 10 News reporter Bob Lawrence has been on top of this story since it broke at midday. He's joining us now live. And Bob, the restaurants were forced to shut down because of a lack of water. Kimberly, I can tell you, if you've covered enough of these water main breaks as I have, you know what's going on behind me is good news. They are filling in the hole. That's where the water main break was early this morning, actually just before 8 a.m. Now, this wasn't a typical main break in that it wasn't an old pipe that gave way. This was an accident by a construction crew that caught businesses and everyone else here by surprise. This isn't the sight or sound Craig Mann usually hears when he sets foot in the burger lounge. It came in through the front door, so pretty much all four corners of the building. And just up the street, vacuum hoses, not customers, were in the door of Masquerade. Owner Dominique Baffield sent us these pictures when she arrived, and she described it as... High tide on the street getting into my store, yes. All my, my wood fixtures are soaking into water. And here's the reason why. This is the repair effort, but it was a construction crew working on another project who made a mistake. They broke some kind of connector or damaged some kind of connector to uh, from one pipe to another, and that blew out a 16-inch water main. The broken connection was eventually shut off, but not until, as you saw, businesses and stores were flooded. But with the water shut off, it also meant that restaurants couldn't open. The closure hit longtime Little Italy restaurateur Joe Busalaki hard. It affects me because I have uh, four restaurants down here, so uh, not good. Not good. And his wasn't the only restaurant affected. Caesar Pantoa of Mimo's Italian restaurant had a double whammy. Yeah, I live just the, on the other block. We also don't have water either. So my wife is back there and she's uh, called me up and said, hey, there's no water. Did you pay the bill? I said, it has nothing to do with the bill. <laughs> this is the second time in about a month that Little Italy had an issue. Before, it was a gas leak that forced evacuations. Now this. Uh, in the restaurant industry, you have to expect anything on any given day. So not too much of a surprise. <laughs> Come. 30. So as you can see, the water is on for most of the uh, businesses and residents in south of Date. Here uh, north of Date on India Street, when's the last time you saw this street this empty? But uh, a lot of the businesses have their water back. Some do not, but most of the businesses here are remain closed. They'll go through the procedures, get it back up to health department code, and they'll be back in business tomorrow. Live in Little Italy, Bob Lawrence, 10 News.